Welcome to the Fraunhofer IPMS Virtual Showroom. As one of our core activities, we are developing large-scale integrated MEMS micromirror arrays, so-called MMAs, for various applications in optical light processing. Please follow me on a short video tour through one of our latest developments, which is a two-axis tip-tilt micromirror array designed for optical beam steering. The device consists of 512 by 320 individually addressable mirrors of 48 microns pixel size. The actuators have been designed for bi-directional tip-tilt motion. They are realized within a two-level architecture with the mirrors on top of four underlying Fletcher beams. Fabrication is done by surface micromachining in a fully CMOS compatible process. The mirrors are electrostatically activated by four underlying address electrodes. The required voltages are feed in via analog storage cells from an integrated CMOS circuitry underneath. This enables a continuous analog tip-tilt motion up to 3.5 degree in arbitrary directions, calibratable at an accuracy of better than 1%. For data transfer and control, an external drive electronics has been developed. It comprises a main unit and a satellite board hosting the MMA chip. In this way, an entire platform is provided, which enables a dynamic generation of arbitrary tip-tilt phase patterns. The optical working principle relies on a pixel-wise redistribution of light. Each mirror creates a beamlet that can be positioned arbitrarily within the focal plane of a subsequent lens. This might be used for a simple redirection of light beams or for the formation and control of variable 2D intensity profiles. Since there are no blocking or filtering elements, it is beneficial for applications where a high light efficiency counts. To visualize and explore the optical capabilities in combination with different light sources, we built a complete optical demonstration system. Employing a blue LED with partially coherent light, a pattern sequence is generated by an appropriate mirror addressing across the array. Therewith, also a continuous pattern motion can be demonstrated. Similarly, an operation under coherent light can be shown by using a green laser. In particular, the coherent case allows a mirror grouping at same deflections to create macro pixels of larger effective size or local blaze gratings. This enables an even better light concentration on spot grids or lines to produce smaller feature sizes. In conclusion, the presented MMA is well suited for the formation of basic intensity patterns, profiles or shapes at minimized light loss. It might be preferably used in combination with low coherence excimer lasers in the DPUV. Applications may be found in laser beam shaping, laser spot tracking or programmable illumination. Another area may be laser material processing, such as laser ablation, engraving or cutting. In a first approach, DPUV laser marking of character strings into various substrates has been successfully proven. After all, the presented mirror technology also offers an enabling platform for a flexible adaptation to other needs in optical signal processing. I hope this has raised your interest. For further information, please contact us at ipms.fraunhofer.de.